It has been nearly two decades since an important piece of Atlanta's history lost its accreditation. With a new president at the helm, Morris Brown College is working to rebuild its brand and once again become accredited. And this week's Whatever Happened to Nick Sturdivant spoke with Morris Brown's president about the uphill journey and the plans for the future. At one point, the school was portrayed in movie theaters across the country. and an integral part of Atlanta culture and history. But now, Morris Brown College is a shell of its former self. With an enrollment of more than 40 students, it has been roughly 17 years since the school lost its accreditation. And so my goal has always been to be a historically black college president. God has brought me to this, to this uh, task. It's a, it's a heavy task, but I'm really enjoying it. Dr. Uh, Kevin James, Morris Brown's newest president, is making it his mission to help bring the college back to its glory days. I saw that the previous president had resigned. I saw it on the news, actually. Well, the president of the historic Morris Brown College in Atlanta announced he will resign at the end of the year. And I was sitting there and I said, you know what? Wow, I want to be the next president of Morris Brown. James is a Columbia, South Carolina native, an educator and former CEO of 100 Black Men. The day-to-day -day is really, really telling the story of Morris Brown and working to raise dollars for this institution. Since taking over in March, he says the school has raised nearly half a million dollars. But James says the goal is to raise 15 million to show the Transnational Association of Christian Colleges and Schools that they are financially stable. The school has already submitted its application for accreditation. So when I came in, I said that I wanted to be the most transparent president um, that I could be to gain the trust of the alumni, the community, shareholders, corporations, donors. And so I strategically post three to five times a day saying, look at what we're doing. God is with us and we're going to restore this institution. Mm -hmm. And Morris Brown has such a big history here in Atlanta. You saw it from that drumline video. It was featured in the movie. Now, Dr. James says the school has also submitted its application to the Georgia Non-Public Post-Secondary Education Commission. And again, the goal is to raise as much money as they can, Chesley.